You came to take us. Jackie Sibley's Jury is an amazing playwright, an amazing theater maker, storyteller, and human being in general that we're just so lucky to have as a key collaborator on Illinois. And we started working together on this in the early stages when I was just barely starting to workshop some of the movement in the studio and just find the, the language of this show. I connected with Jackie and we started this process of dreaming up what a narrative through line could be for the show in a way that utilizes the entirety of the album. I first got involved with Illinois after Justin Peck reached out and he'd been dreaming of this show. And I feel like I loved the album since my own sort of early adulthood and was really intrigued to see what he thought the piece could be. And he wanted to be really faithful to the way that the album was made, having there be really amazing musicians and having the music not be completely sonically different from it is on the album. Like he also had this conceit of a group of hikers going into the woods to tell stories and one person in particular having a real autobiographical story to tell. And so that was really compelling to me. And so we sort of went off to the races, I guess, from there. So the show itself kind of bounces from storyteller to storyteller until we land on our central protagonist who takes us through this sort of surprising coming of age story and how he left his small hometown and made this sort of bold decision to move to the big city to find his community, to discover his own voice and to find a sense of belonging. I think that the story itself was formed from a lot of personal experiences and most of the narratives come from either myself or Jackie or Sufyan in through his music and in that way it feels almost like semi-autobiographical even though there's a lot of liberties taken with that storytelling I would say like the inspiration comes from those autobiographical experiences but then we allow our imaginations to run free and also find like what the most impactful order and balance of those narratives are in relation to the music itself. It felt like some of the songs fit together to create this path for a person, for like a young person to have gone on, and some just didn't as cleanly fit into that. And so we sort of tried to pull those out and turn them each into their own piece. There was something exciting from the beginning that Justin was like, I want to just do the album straight through, no rearranging, we're not gonna like leave anything out. And eventually that became sort of impossible once this protagonist sort of like identified himself. But there is something that's been this guiding star of not leaving anything out. And every single track on the album is in the show. And that's also like as a, com if anyone who's like a completist, that's like something that's, that's very satisfying. So yeah, it's been um, a very unique and specific process to write this thing. And it feels like we've had to live to a certain point to then be able to like look back and reflect on certain times, especially this idea of coming of age. This is very much a coming of age story. And I've always loved coming of age stories from when I was young up until this point today. So, so it's a real dream to get to tell that kind of story within the context of Illinois, the album. I hope that after seeing the show, people feel like they've had an emotional catharsis. I know that that's like very academic, but I do think that the show asks you to empathize with this character and how hard it was for him to share his story and by doing that, have a little bit more empathy for ourselves and how difficult it is to just be a person in this world. It feels like an exercise in empathy in a, in a way that feels important now. Like, I, I hope that people leave feeling a little bit tender because it, it seems like that's something that we um, need more of, honestly.